Should be one right around here. Down in there. Fish. Oh, got him. Good one. Good one. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Is that what I think it is? It is. That is the most gigantic rock bass that I have seen. I thought, I literally thought that was a smallmouth coming in. Look at the size of that rock bass. He's huge. He must be about 11 or heading toward 12 inches long. That is a big, big rock bass. Wow. You got to love it. You got to love it. Everything's hitting the little four inch worm. Small mouth, large mouth, huge rock bass. You got to love it. Got to love it. Oh, yeah. All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wow, wow, <laughs> that was amazing. You r very rarely catch them that big in Ohio. All right, I'm gonna take my little bait, make sure the line is, is good, no nicks on it. Make sure that hook is set in there like it's supposed to be and I'm gonna put it back to work. hard to control this with all the wind. Ooh, didn't even see him grab it. Now, what is that? Rock bass, all right. That's what's been sneaking up and grabbing my bait. It's a good sign. Anywhere, anytime you're in an area and you catch rock bass, you can catch smallmouth too. All right. Homeward bound, homeward bound. Gotta love it, gotta love it. Ooh, there we go. There we go. All right, what's that one? Another rock bass. These rock bass are fat around here and they hit top water plugs. Wow. All right, hold still. Hold still. Hemostats. Go to R&R &R Bait and Tackle. Pick you up a pair of these. Always have them on the boat. Oh, they'll even help you get yourself unhooked if you get hooked. There you go. Google Eye. Thank you. Need bait and tackle for your next fishing trip? Go to R&R, &R, the best in the Buckeye State.